Welcome back on Dynamod. Today I want to propose you a video about uh, the personalization about the Lich Carlos as a Crematorius in Immortoi type. And this model comes from the set box of the Brokeriums Horek Venzai Horex Dreadlands. So this is something that I really liked to do and now we can see how I converted. First thing to do is to remove the part of the rocks of the part of the base that you low to add to the legs or better to the foot and so on in the way that uh, it's uh, more free to put it on the base as i want so it's something that uh, i have to do and to do this uh, i use a bit of blue tack uh, or patafix or so on to keep there the pieces while i cut them from the rocket themselves so you have to pay a lot of attention here because uh, it's not so great sometimes and it's better if you prepare yourself to do this before to attach the feet to the miniature itself. Otherwise it will be quite problematic then to have the freedom to move around the pieces so to cut in a really great way because the rock themselves and the other pieces you can use for other minus eventually so they can be reused. Then I used a trick, I used the tin foil to create a bit of thickness so I don't use to have too much material, for example, Snow, the Valley or so on, to create the amount that I needed. So you can play with it to create and create volume, so it can be a nice trick. And then I glued the books that I made cloning, the ones that I had with metal and so on, and I have a lot of times these clones ready and uh, I made such uh, scrolls, uh, such books and so on, put on the base, continue verifying the model on the base itself because I needed to be positioning in perfect way and so I glued when I found the perfect position of all the books. About the scrolls uh, I used uh, the cutting of some of the sprue but uh, sincerely I suggest you to use some paper card or so on so that uh, it's easier to realize the same thing. And then I verified that everything worked perfect for the base, so I verified that uh, all the pieces were good together, the mod was on the base and it was okay on it, and thought if it was okay to put other things later after that I put the snow van layer or before, so to decide when to paint and put the other things so that I had to decide how to use such things. So I take a, a bit of time, but it was useful to make my mind about such base and the mod itself on it. And then I painted the books dirty on the base, putting on also the writings about it, you can find in the description of the video about. So I used a different chart in each book so that it seemed that it came from a library, that it's a collection of books. And so I liked a lot, moreover, because you can see also the size comparing about such books with a cent of uh, the euros. Then I used the snow of the Vallejo to create the terrain itself and covered the books so that it was similar that I, the books were thrown on the terrain itself so that could be a bit dirty of it too. And then I used also in such a way to put on it some other books that I created to get a bit of more casual and I had a bit of fun to get some cover for the books that if you see the previous ones were not visible. With this I could make some particular cover about the books themselves. And then as usual I used the agate shade to give the color to the snow valley so that it gave me that color that I like about the turn itself. About the horse and the rider, I paint them as I done for the colors the riders and the colors as I done in the video about the flames. So you can find both the video in the description. And I simply crisscrossed, it was a bit of error, but I liked the final result, the colors of the flames. So I made the half of the model and but a quarter of the model in red and the opposite quarter, diagonally one, in the red two and the opposite, the blue ones. And I load the effect of the crisscrossing of the flames that I done for both the rider and the mount itself. A couple of notes to remember. The first one is about the screws that you can find under the hind legs. I paint them before to glue that 
bone part on it so that it was visible and it was reachable otherwise it's a bit problematic and i think it's about the weapon arm for the rider that i magnetize so that i can switch both the weapons so the spear and the sword but my idea is to make both of them thanks to the magnet. I used the same that I done for the Call of Riders using the 2 for 2 millimeter ones. Still, it's up to you to decide if you want such or choose which one you prefer. We have been born from Nagash will. We have been doomed to be fair flies by him. We subtly denied him when he was full body and soul. We seek survive. We made a path within ourselves, we search for a cure. Nagash is weak now, and our action show open and bright kneeling to him, but we ransack for wisdom, our desire for freedom burning as much as our own bodies. It's not even more, we are in his disposable weapon, will be our own. Destiny. So, from Dino Mode, it's everything. I invite you to put a like on this video, to subscribe to the channel, to ring the bell, and to comment this video if you are interested in something about this video or you want to suggest me some arguments for other videos. I hope to see you again. To the next time!